Strickland, it is a sad day for Gamecock fans as the man who was called Gamecock Jesus has passed away after a battle with cancer. If you have ever been to a home basketball game, you know him well. I can pinpoint his seat uh, inside this, the stu stadium. Reggie Anderson joins us live now in studio with more. Reggie. Yeah, it wasn't just uh, basketball. In fact, uh, we have some video of him at volleyball matches as well. He was out front and center with the uh, waving the waving the flag. He had his Believe shirt on. But yeah, just a just an absolutely kind individual, very gentle soul. Uh, Carlton Thompson passing away the age of 69 after a brave battle with prostate cancer. Of course, as you mentioned, he was always a fixture at Gamecock sporting events. You see the beard, you see the headband, you've got the garnet shirt, and there he is at a volleyball match. In fact, uh, not only Dawn Staley, but also the uh, Gamecock volleyball team acknowledging his passing and uh, saying some very moving things on social media today. And if you really think about it, you've got Carlton Thompson, but also a couple of uh, months ago, we lost Tommy Moody, the longtime Gamecock baseball analyst, former Gamecock infielder, just two very kind, gentle souls, and they are no longer with us. It's really been a tough uh, way to in uh, 2023, but uh, as you mentioned, Carlton Thompson, Thompson, they called him Gamecock Jesus. Uh, most people just called him a, just a friend. Anybody never met a stranger, just a good guy, always had a smile on his face and uh, no longer with us. Gamecock sporting events will not be the same. Absolutely, Reggie. And, you know, we remember back in 2017, there was that crowdfunding to send him to go see the Final Four. Is he Don Staley? Well, yeah, actually you had that. And also, again, you, when you think about the, that, the outpouring of support that he had to do that, it's like, you know, that's what uh, that's how much people uh, people that's what people thought of him. Reggie, thank you so much. People on social media shared their love on Gamecock Jesus today across the Midlands. The Colonial Life Arena even took to their Twitter account to post this. It reads in part his passion, his energy, his support, his love of the Gamecocks. We will never forget Carlton Thomas, our Thompson, I should say, our beloved Gamecock Jesus. Gamecock Athletics posted Carlton Thompson, our beloved Gamecock Jesus, has the best seat in the house tonight. He loved the Gamecocks and we loved him. Another tweet reads, I can't believe that our beloved Gamecock Jesus, Carlton Thompson, has passed away. You would always find him at every basketball game and he was a part of all of our lives. Please keep his family in your prayers. Also, the USC men's basketball team also took to Twitter today to simply t uh, tweet out Believe. We've also gotten tweets uh, on posts on social media uh, from Don Staley, who was mm -hmm. a huge supporter of his as well. And I say supporter of his. We know he was showing up to support Our the heart. women's basketball team, but it, the love went both ways for them. Coach Khadijah Sessions posting about him today. So he really impacted everybody that stepped foot in Colonial Life Arena. And um, interestingly enough, Gamecocks basketball plays tonight against Clemson. All right, folks, we're going to take a look.